hey the wonderful cheesesteak you're back inside of fallout 4 and today i'm doing lovable where we have to reach max lovability ranking with character partners in other words you just have to be reach 100 percent relationship level anyway for this example i'm using curie the robot from vault 81 well secret vault 81 now just do some um one thing I recommend is doing the Minuteman quest because if, as long as you say yes, I'll help, nine out of ten times you will always gain favor with her. And this is after I think two actual missions uh, of actual this of actually doing this, and she'll ask you to uh, take her to some place where she can gain a body. Now the only place that I'm aware that well, actually the only place you can do this is the memory den, and what you need to do is approach the doctor now. The only reason I've slowed this down a bit is I also recommend getting either the red dress or there's another uh, equipable item. It's basically uh, someone's uh, uniform or something. Uh, these two will boost your charisma as there are some speech checks. So if you do not have at least charisma 6, I highly recommend that you learn the art of quick saving. Because... If you're not good with speech checks, this can, you know, turn out and bite you in the end. Uh, I'm actually using the silver shroud armor. That armor's still good. It's one of my personal favorites. Of course, it's not the best in the game, but it's been one of my personal favorites. Anyway, though, so what we're going to do is wait at least 24 hours. And when you do, we will now see our good friend. I uh, can't remember who she is off the top of my head because this is actually an older recording combined with newer recordings. So anyway, this is that moment where I told you about speech checks. So anyway, through immersion behavior, I actually had to... Oh, that's right, here we go. The red dress right up here. Uh, you can, if you wear it, you get... If you wear that tuxedo, you get plus one, but charisma two with the red dress. Yes, I'm using, as a, using this as a male character, and, well, it's weird. Oh, Glory, that's where she is. Anyway, you'll have a speech check down there, and basically either... Uh, something or another. Anyway, after you do this, there won't be any other speech checks. There's nothing really to worry about. But uh, Kiri will go through her whole spiel, more things, and, you know, for a synth, she doesn't look half bad. Anyway, for uh, Lovable, we don't actually have to start a romance with them. We just have to reach maximum companionship level. Now, for this example, I will be using the romance option, but that's completely up to you. As you can do this with many other characters, including Kate, Piper, Nick, if you get his friendship up high enough. Um, there's, a, there's a bunch of guys. Anyway, so just, one of, like I stated, after you do get uh, Curie into her synth body, you're going to have to do a lot of questing. Lots and lots of questing. I'm not kidding. But anyway, after you do a bunch of questing, this is that uh, Reginald suit. I can't remember where I found it. I'll probably put it up on the screen. I was doing some of the Silver Shroud stuff, and as long as you're doing the helpful the helpful option, uh, you should be good. But anyway, whenever you see the flirt option pop up on the screen, select it as long as you're wearing Reginald suit or the red dress. And you will most times success in your, succeed in your speech check again. Uh, this is probably my... Fourth encounter? Six, no, I say sixth encounter. Something like that. I've actually sped this up. Lots of jump cuts. Not really jump cuts. Not intentionally. But anyway, as I stated, whenever flirt comes up, always select it. Now, this is actually my final uh, speech check and final conversation with Curie, wearing, of course, Reginald's suit. And, of course, we're going to approach her one more time. And, of course, flirt. That'll raise her... Because uh, shortly before this, I had, you know, tr settler trouble in Sanctuary. I said, sure, I'll help. And I got idolized. Now, if you get idolized, you're pretty much there. Uh, there is a, f a couple more speech checks you need to do. Other than that, you're pretty much safe. Uh, I did speak through the conversation here. Uh, you will then see romance. Now, you can see uh, my friend, too, or anyone's. But again, I'm just doing this for the achievement. Again, if you quick save, get the achievement, and then go back and say, I want you as a friend. I do believe you still get her perk. So, uh, deep feelings, just stay friends. That's, again, up to you. But anyway, once you do finally do that, you will then get either uh, this won't work, start a relationship, love. Of course, this is the romance option, not necessarily the friendship option. So, again, up to you. 
I can't remember anything else off the top of my head. Anyway, once you do get through this conversation, she will then actually get a nice little green screen here saying, you've gotten the combat medic perk. So in other words, once you get the perk of the character you're chasing after, then the achievement will unlock right here. So that again, that's 20 gamer score for doing this. It isn't a difficult achievement, but it can be a bit pesky, especially with some of the characters like Codsworth is swapping up in mods and stuff. So anyway, there you guys go. Thank you guys for watching. If this helped you, hit like. If you do, in fact, want to see more, why not click on that photo down there? Go to my channel and, I don't know, maybe hit subscribe after you see some of my stuff. Or click on the video above and, you know, check out how to get a thousand resource items. And as always, have a great and beautiful day, and uh, hopefully I'll see you guys all next time.